Hey guys, this is Malinki. Welcome back to my channel, Voice of Malinki. Today we will talk about anti-diuretic hormone. And if you are new in my channel, please subscribe my channel. And if you like my video, please do like, comment, and share my video. So, anti-diuretic hormone or ADH is also called vasopressin. Now, this is the hypothalamus here in this picture. This is the anterior pituitary and this is the posterior pituitary. And this is the hypothalamic neuron here. So, hypothalamic neurons secrete ADH that enters the posterior pituitary. Posterior pituitary stores and release them. So, I have already made a lecture regarding hypothalamic control of the posterior pituitary. If you didn't go through that lecture, I would highly recommend you to have a look on that lecture. Link is provided in the description box. Function. So, ADH has two main functions in our body. First, it conserves body water by decreasing urine volume. Second, it raises blood pressure. So, two major stimuli promote ADH secretion. A rise in blood osmolarity and a decrease in blood volume. So, high blood osmolarity means the number of solute particles is more or high in blood. Now, high blood osmolarity is detected by hypothalamic sensory neurons which are also called osmoreceptors that monitor changes in the blood osmolarity. Once stimulated, osmoreceptors activate the hypothalamic neurons that synthesize and release ADH into posterior pituitary. From posterior pituitary, this hormone is released into the bloodstream. Blood carries ADH to the kidneys. The kidneys respond by retaining more water which decreases urine output. One more stimulus of ADH secretion is decrease in blood volume. Decreased blood volume is detected by volume receptors in the atrium of the heart. Once stimulated, atrial volume receptors activate the hypothalamic neurons that synthesize and release ADH into the posterior pituitary. From posterior pituitary, this hormone is released into the bloodstream. Blood carries ADH to the smooth muscle in blood vessel walls. Smooth muscle in the walls of the blood vessels contracts in response to ADH which constricts or making narrow the lumen of the blood vessels and increases blood pressure. 